Hi, I'm Ola England and this is the Washburn Parallax PXL20. The body is made of mahogany, so is the neck, and it has a set neck construction, uh, but with a pretty good access to it. It's uh, kind of a Stevens cutaway inspired uh, access, so you can get really, it's very deep, so you can get really high up on the neck without any problems at all. Tunematic bridge with a sustain plate, EMG pickups, 81 and 85. Freeway toggle switch, and two volume knobs, one for the bridge and one for the neck pickup and a tow knob. The neck uh, fretboard is ebony. And it has uh, the neck has 22 frets and the scale of the neck is 24 and 3 quarters of an inch, which is kind of standard for a Les Paul guitar. Super Yumbo frets. The neck shape is uh, very C it's very C shape. Shaped. It, uh, it's very, it's very comfortable. Plays really well. And the neck also has a bus phaeton, which is a tuning system. Basically, it's uh, the distance between the nut and the first fret is shorter than on regular guitars. So what that does, it eliminates uh, notes getting sharp on the three first frets. And uh, if you want to read more about Bus Faden, check the video description for links. The headstock uh, has Grover blocking tuners. It's an awesome playing guitar. It's made in Indonesia, and the quality is just super awesome. The finish it looks great, and all the joints look awesome. And overall, it's a very super awesome playing guitar. Really, I mean, it's very comfortable to play. It's very thin, so it sits very close to your body. And um, I would totally recommend this guitar. And for info on pricing and availability, check the video description for links. And you can also download direct input files of uh, me playing the guitar, so you can use it in your own setup. 
and see how that sounds using reamping. If you don't know what reamping is, you can Google that or just search it on YouTube and you'll find guides on how to do that. But basically it's like you're getting the, the signal from the guitar. You can download that signal, get it in your own home setup and you can plug it into your amp and see how this guitar sounds for your stuff really. And uh, that's it.